Greetings, fitness enthusiasts. I'm Professor Noatal, and today, I want to start by thanking you all for your fantastic suggestions for our health and fitness series. Your curiosity and engagement fuel our community, and I'm excited to tackle today's topic, five myths about fitness exercises. Let's clear up these misconceptions and get you on the right track for your fitness journey. Myth one, no pain, no gain. Reality, pain is not a measure of a good workout. While some discomfort is normal, especially when starting a new routine, pain can indicate an injury. Listen to your body and avoid pushing through pain. Proper form and gradual progress are key. Myth two, spot reduction works. Reality, you can't target fat loss in specific areas through exercise alone. Spot reduction is a myth. Fat loss occurs throughout the body and is influenced by genetics, diet, and overall exercise routine. Focus on a balanced approach combining cardio, strength training, and a healthy diet. Myth 3. More exercise equals better results. Reality. Quality over quantity matters. Overexercising can lead to burnout, injuries, and decreased motivation. Effective workouts are about intensity and proper technique. Ensure you include rest days to allow your muscles to recover and grow. Myth 4. Cardio is the only way to lose weight. Reality. While cardio is excellent for burning calories, strength training is equally important. Building muscle increases your resting metabolic rate, which helps burn more calories throughout the day. A combination of cardio and strength training yields the best results. Myth 5. You need fancy equipment or a gym membership. Reality. Effective workouts can be done anywhere, using minimal or no equipment. Bodyweight exercises, such as push-ups, squats, and planks, can provide a challenging and effective workout. Creativity and consistency are more important than expensive equipment. Conclusion. Don't let these fitness myths derail your progress. Understanding the facts can help you create a balanced and effective workout routine that suits your needs. Now, let's make this interactive. What fitness myths have you encountered? Share your experiences and questions in the comments below. If you found this lesson valuable, give it a like, follow for more fitness insights, and share it with friends and family. Comment on what topics you'd like to explore next. Your suggestions keep our series engaging and informative. Until next time, stay informed and keep moving. This is Professor Noatal, signing off.